guys welcome back to my channel this is Maisha here today we are going to learn about block quote quote and site tag okay let's create a file here now I'm going to do all the basic things you know how to do it so do it yourself first what is a block quote it's very simple Normally when we have a block of quote to show in our website, we are going to use block quote. Here I'm going to put a block of quote. This is a block of quote. In block quote, you can use the attribute site where you put the link to this block quote. For example, where you took this quote from. If you took this quote from a website, you use this site attribute to point to that URL. Let's point to it. Okay. I have point to the site from where I have took this block quote from. So this is how you use block quote. You simply use the site attribute to point to the URL from where you have taken it. If there is no site and you took it from a book yourself, you don't need to use site. It's not necessary that you have to use the site quote. The next tag we're going to know about is site. Site tags are used for creative work to denote creative works. For example, this block quote, I took it from a book. So the name of the book is to be put inside the site tag. So let's do it. I'm going to put everything inside this p tag. Now we are going to use the site tag. Inside the site tag, I'm going to use a tag to link to the website where you can find this book. Which is the same link. It's not necessary that it has to be the same link but in my case it is the same link so inside the site tag you don't need to use any attribute inside the site tag we use a anchor tag a denotes anchor this is an anchor tag anchor tags are used to create links i'm going to do go more in depth about a tags later on in this course so don't forget to subscribe to this channel make sure you subscribe and hit the bell icon and give this video a like so this is the book's name and you will get this book in this website that's why we have used this a tag and site is to denote the book's name we use the site tag to point that this is a creative work this is a book's name you can use site tags for various things for example here you can use site tag for this, a book's name, a research paper, an essay, a poem, musical score. You can use these kinds of names inside the site tag. You can link to them using a tag. So this is what site tags are used for. Now the next thing we're going to learn is a quote tag, inline quote tag. Let me create a paragraph. And suppose in this paragraph, inside this paragraph, there is a quote. And suppose this is the quote, then he should know better. Suppose this is a quote. So for inline quotes in a paragraph, if you want to just, if there is just one line quote, you simply use Q tag. There. For inline quotes, you use Q tag, and in Q tag, you can also use the site attribute, as in from where you took this quote from. If there is any other website you want to quote to, link to, or cite to, you can use this attribute. It doesn't do anything or link anything. We're going to see what it does very soon. So I'm going to use the same link.
it's from the same website in my case so I've taken this quote from this website that's why I've used the site attribute to quote so there you go you use block quote for a longer quotes you use site for pointing to creative work names for example book research paper essay or poem for these kinds of names you use site tag and for inline quotes you use q tag now let's see what our website looks like right click and open with live server see this is our block of quote and this is the author name that we wrote in this paragraph and this is our link that we created inside site tag if you don't want to use the anchor tag you can omit it let's omit it and see what it looks like let's not use anchor tag and see see it gives a style it's in italic and now let's see what our inline quote looks like you see we didn't use any quotation mark here but due to this q tag it already gave a quotation mark itself you get a quotation mark by default so that's it for today guys if you don't understand anything let me know in the comment section also subscribe to my channel and like this video don't forget to follow me on social medias i've linked them down below also in the screen thank you